Hey guys, Outdoor Jack here, and snow goose season is just around the corner. So what I want to do is I want to get more rounds into my shotgun. With that, the only way to do that is to take out the plug and add a magazine extension tube. So let's walk through the steps of how you can put on a magazine extension tube on your shotgun or just about any shotgun. So the first thing that you're going to need to do is to remove the forend and magazine cap on your shotgun. Take that off, set that aside, and then as you can see here, let's do this, move it here. As you can see, basically you have everything exposed here, right? What you're gonna have to do is take the plug out, the plug out, then what you're gonna need to do is take the cap that holds the spring out, right? Okay. So after you've taken the spring out of the magazine tube, set that aside, then you're going to need to take the shell stopper that's on the bottom side of the magazine tube where you load out as well. Sometimes you may have to disassemble the whole entire magazine tube to get that out. Other times you can flip the gun over, let that drop down to the bottom and pull it right out. If that's the case, that makes this process so much easier. So after you've done that, you've got your Carlson Magazine Extension Kit. Take everything out of there. Before you even get started on any of the other process, the first thing you want to do is make sure that you've got the correct magazine extension tube. The easy way to figure this out is to just take the magazine tube out of the packaging and just start to screw it on here. If it doesn't screw or align correctly, then you know you have the wrong magazine tube and you need to make sure that you get the right one to move forward. So this one threads on perfectly, so it's the correct tube for this specific shotgun. So what each kit comes with is the orange stopper, the tube, the clamp for a sling, and just stability, as well as a new spring, longer spring. So what we need to do is get on the inside of here and make sure that everything is smoothed out. And what you can do with that is just get a piece of sandpaper and go on the inside of this and sand all that out. Once, it's, once that thing goes and flies right through there, a shotgun shell will too. Get yourself some fine sandpaper and fold it up. Get it on the inside of that tube and just make sure the inside of that tube is completely smooth. Sometimes to get some of those burrs out of there from the stopper, you may need a small um, file type tool. This is a specific um, curved file tool that I'm going to go in there and try to sand those pieces out. Okay, so now that you have um, everything filed out in there and it slides back and forth very easily, you need to put your spring on, the forehand, spring in, all right, and then magazine tube on top of that, punch that down, and thread on the magazine extension tube. Make sure that is snug. You don't want to over tighten it because um, you could strip something out there, but you want it to be snug. Then, basically the last thing that you can do is put on your barrel um, keeper here. This really just kind of protects the, the barrels and this from just wanting to break the tube at the top. If you were to catch it on something, spread that apart. So those are the simple processes of how to add a magazine extension tube to your shotgun. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and learn more and watch some of my other videos as well. Thanks for watching, and God bless. Mm -hmm.